Hey everyone, welcome back. And in today's video, we're gonna be talking about VPNs, why they've become essential these days, and my top three VPN picks to use in the Philippines. And without further ado, let's get started. Also, if at any point in this video, you'd like to check out any of the VPNs that I mentioned today, you'll find all the useful links, including discounts, in the description down below. Now, one of the main reasons to use a VPN in the Philippines is to protect your digital privacy. And that's because their internet service providers must collect and keep your data for six months. When using a reputable VPN, however, all your data is encrypted and protected from your ISP and any other prying eyes. This is especially useful if you often use public Wi-Fi, as it's the most vulnerable to cyber attacks. Also, if you're living in the Philippines, you might not be able to access all streaming platforms, and most of the time they have shows that are only available in specific countries. Also, some websites and e-banking platforms might not be available there due to certain legislation. Also, if you're traveling outside the Philippines, some exclusive streaming platforms such as PTV and RPN won't be available. With a VPN, however, you can virtually change your location to any country you want, therefore accessing all their streaming services, websites, and e-banking platforms. One thing to note is that not all VPNs are created equal, as some of them have a limited number of servers and others try to sell your information. That's why I made a list of my top three VPN picks in order to help you make a more informed decision and pick a service that best fits your situation. But before that, it's important to note that this video is meant for educational purposes only, and I do not support or condone any illegal activities using these VPNs. So please make sure that your online actions are responsible and align with your country's policies and regulations. And so I've been testing out some of the most popular VPNs out there, and I've narrowed them down to ExpressVPN, NordVPN, and Surfshark as my top three picks overall. Now, all three VPNs work remarkably well with streaming services. They provide some of the best speeds, they're very easy to use, and they also have the necessary security features such as the kill switch, split tunneling, and a bunch of protocols. But of course, they still vary in what features they offer and how much they cost, and picking out the best service for you will depend on what you're looking for in a VPN. So let me break down each service individually to help you make a more informed decision. First up, we have ExpressVPN, which is overall the best pick as it came first in most major categories like speed, security, and privacy. Now, in terms of reliability, ExpressVPN has proven its commitment to protecting user data several times by conducting many audits over the years. On top of going through a real-life stress test where the Turkish government seized one of its servers in an ongoing investigation, only to find nothing that can be linked to any specific user. Besides that, ExpressVPN has over 3,000 servers in 105 countries, allowing you to access almost any content from all around the world. But what's so impressive about these servers is their consistency and reliability. Whether I'm streaming, gaming, or torrenting, I've had great speeds and uninterrupted connections. And besides being super simple to use, my favorite thing about ExpressVPN is how responsive it is across all devices. Launching the app only takes a few seconds, and connecting to any server takes a single second or less, which isn't something that I can say about any other VPN. And so if you're looking for the overall best, fastest, and most reliable VPN out there, ExpressVPN is your go-to. Next up we have NordVPN, which offers the most value for money out of the three options. It's got some bonus features that make it a little more than just a simple VPN. Such features include threat protection, which blocks ads and malware-ridden websites, and also protects your device from harmful files. And in terms of speeds, NordVPN actually rivals ExpressVPN, especially when it comes to gaming and overall performance. Besides that, NordVPN has 6,300 servers in 111 countries, which is the largest number of countries I've seen a VPN offer access to. Also, more servers generally means that the user base is more widely spread across the servers, so there is basically more room for everyone to use, making connection speeds a little bit faster. And another thing I really like about NordVPN is its intuitive user interface, which has a huge map of all of its servers, allowing you to pick and choose the closest server to you with a couple of clicks. And when it comes to device limits, NordVPN allows you to connect up to six devices with one subscription, as opposed to the five device limit of ExpressVPN. And so if you're looking for the best value VPN, Nord offers a few more useful features, an intuitive interface, and great overall performance. And finally, we have Surfshark, which is gonna be the best budget VPN on this list, because unlike ExpressVPN and NordVPN, Surfshark allows you to protect an unlimited number of devices under one subscription, which is great for households and businesses. Now, it might not be as fast as these two, but it offers the essential VPN features on top of some bonus ones like an ad blocker, two types of specialty servers, as well as no borders mode and rotating IP, which can be very useful in restrictive countries. Not only that, but it offers a huge server list of 3,200 servers in 100 countries, which gives it a lot of value. And so if you're looking for the best budget VPN that allows unlimited simultaneous connections on top of having the core features of a VPN, Surfshark is your go-to. So to sum it up, if you're looking for the overall best, fastest, and most reliable service with arguably the best privacy policy out there, ExpressVPN is easily your go-to option. NordVPN is gonna be the one to get if you're looking for a well-rounded VPN that offers bonus features while maintaining great performance and security for a reasonable price. 
And finally, Surfshark is the best budget VPN, as it allows for unlimited connections and offers the core features of a premium VPN at the cheapest possible cost. Oh, and one more thing before I sign off, if you do decide to get any of these VPNs, just make sure you know what plan to get. You see, I've spoken with ExpressVPN, and it seems that most people think that they're not going to need a VPN for more than a month, so they get the monthly plan. However, most of the time, it turns out that they end up using the VPN for more than a month, so it keeps resubscribing at the much higher rate of the monthly rate, when they could have paid way less if they opted for one of the larger plans. So if you're absolutely sure that you're only going to need a VPN for a month, then by all means get the monthly plan. But if you're not sure or think you're going to need it for more than a month, then you'd be saving a lot more money if you opt for one of the longer term plans. And this applies to all three VPNs, by the way, not just Express. And that'll be all for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to check out the links in the description to grab yourself the best discounts possible. Like and subscribe to see more of these videos, and let me know in the comments if there's anything cybersecurity you'd like me to cover. Again, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.